Every year, at least 40% of the world's crops are lost. 30% of medical plants are threatened with extinction. Pollution, urbanization, and global warming are cross-country challenges in agriculture. It's time to break new ground. It's time for a change. Imagine that your selected plant can be artificially preserved forever and remain unaltered. In vitro-based cloning not only allows us to create 100% identical plants or guarantee traceability down to the DNA, but also enables us to save vital cultivation time and bypass the sprouting stage. The sterile clone is now placed in the Capsero capsule and made transportable with nutrient supply. Plant cultures can be stored, regenerated, and shipped to customers as required and just in time. Imagine a fully automated, decentralized, and highly efficient cultivation module for pharmaceutical and cosmetic plants. DNA Pure capsules are automatically inserted into the module. Plants are identified and the cultivation protocol is loaded. Decontamination starts to protect plants from contamination such as bacteria, viruses, or spores. The capsules are opened and the plants are grown according to cultivation protocols that are tailored to the genetics of the plant and not only monitored, but also optimized by our artificial intelligence. Imagine an autonomous harvesting module that docks to the grow container, seals, and equalizes atmospheres. Fully automatically, one of the racks is drawn into the harvest container by a cutting-edge robotic system with a dedicated data processing and visual system. The plants are harvested, sealed, and prepared for further processing. Imagine intelligence from an unlimited amount of data points. Imagine a global network of decentralized container farms. And imagine a centralized marketplace where supply and demand alone determine the price and where plant availability increases close to infinity. Imagine a world where medical plants can be planted, grown, harvested, processed, sold, and purchased through one single platform at the push of a button.